Hello everybody, Retro Beard here. How are you all doing? It's Thursday afternoon, almost 5 p.m. GMT British time. Um, I hope you're all doing well. You've had a good day and things are going well for you. Um, before I get started, I want to say if you enjoy my content, please remember to like, subscribe, share, click the notification bell, leave me a comment. It all really big time helps the channel, so it's much appreciated. Um, with that said, let's have a look at what we can do today. We had quite a good little session yesterday. I can't live on Final Fight forever. Maybe I could, but you know, it might be a bit boring for anybody watching. Let's have a look. Is there anything here that resonates with me? Let's have a scroll down. I'm not going to go through all the SNES games. I'm going to handpick a few because it drains me going through an entire list. I like to do it sometimes, but it isn't always in me to just endlessly go for every game. Hi, Dark. Welcome back, my friend. I, uh, I'm very good, thank you. How are you? I hope you're feeling good. We missed you yesterday. Had quite a good stream, but you were missed by your friends. Even Cauldron came along. Was it? We had some of the old crew. California Games too. I don't know if you can play this one. I loved the first one back in the day, but I'm not very good at it anymore, which is a bit annoying. But when we were young, we had time to practice. I don't want to name. I just want to play the game. I hate names in games that aren't RPGs. All this utilise the amazing Mode 7. Oh wow, this is... This is something, isn't it? Uh-oh. Dweeb. That's nice, isn't it? I'm getting abuse. Zero. How do you get zero? Is this just as annoying as part one? Oh wow, look at that. At the old mode seven. So you have been busy. It's frustrating when disaster happens and you kind of work hard and have absolutely nothing to show it. It drives me insane. Kind of like this game. Yeah, I'm turning this game off. Yeah. I know you feel. I've had that where I work hard and it all goes wrong and I have nothing to show for it. But hopefully it's, um, it's all worked out for you and you've not been driven too insane. Let's have a look at this game. Mm. Let's give it a go. Yeah, I don't care about that. Let's go try the game. Is this Road Rash on Bicycles? Gosh, how do you, wow, this is a choppy mess, choppy as hell. No sound effects. Oh, I'm glad you got it third time lucky, my friend, so you have got something to show for your work then, that's good. Um, a happy ending, as we would say. We were churning out some, fi um, some final fight yesterday. We had a good, a good stream, really. I hope we have a good one today, which I'm sure we will, because we usually do, don't we? This seems to be awful.
choppy as hell and it, they don't look special. It's trying to do the mode 7, but it's just not doing it any favours. Mode 7 looked like this all the time, people wouldn't have been impressed with it, would they? Not all Super Nintendo games are made equal. That's what we'll say. Those sound effects. I thought it's better on an 8-bit machine. Makes you wonder our programmers in good conscience banged out crap like this and actually thought it was going to be a success. Yeah, Final Fight's awesome. I think we all like a bit of Final Fight, don't we? And the Super Nintendo had some very, very good showings of it. I know the Mega CD probably had the ultimate version, but I think the Super Nintendo had a very, very respectable showing for, you know, for a standard 16-bit cartridge. And the two-player modes are sweet. Five laps left, I don't think so. Have a drink. <sighs> Let's have a look. Captain America and the Avengers. We played it on the Sega, we played it on the arcade. Now let's try um, something similar on the SNES, the mighty SNES. My name on a game like that. I agree. Height six foot four. In his suit, maybe not out, not outside of it. Six foot three. It's definitely before the MCU, isn't it? Let's have a look. Easy. Bit of, oh, it's got a two player mode, that's good. Who shall I be? Iron Man. Give this a go. I don't want to read, I just want to play. America, still needs your help. Very arcadey. Avengers Assemble. Okay, the game needs to have a screen on it. Oh. Okay. Yeah, it's not always their decision, is it? I suppose they've got other influences. God, Iron Man's a wuss in this. One hit and he's on his back. Oh God, this plays like crap. Come on, Iron Man, you can't take a hit. This is awful. I expected so much from the snares. This is the easy mode. Welcome to the stream. Hello, my friend. I hope you're doing well. I'm very disappointed with this. I expected better. For the mighty Super Nintendo. Yeah, I, I don't like this game at all. It, I mean, the Super Nintendo's power, I expected something really special. One touch and you die. What's that about? I think I 
happy to leave this game. There's too many good games out there for me to be playing crap. Truthfully. Shooting collection. Carry your aces. I'll get slaughtered on that. No choplifter, because I've put down. Chrono Trigger is not really a casual game. Chuck Rock, drop, give Chuck Rock a go. <sighs> Hopefully, we will um, get lucky on this. I want to get lucky. Look how, look how bright that is. Just, oh, then it goes darker again. Madness. This is madness. Chuck Rock. This was quite a lot of headlines back in the day. It was quite popular. Not really a game I spent much time playing, but I've seen it in magazines and stuff and used to be jealous of the Amiga graphics. Has he got a fighting button? Or does he just jump? Is that all he can do? Okay, he just jumps. He can't jump on people's heads either. What have you been playing? He can't jump on things, so what's the point of this old boy? Yeah, this game's complete crap. A platform game where you can't jump on the head or fight, what's the point? Clay fighter, no. Just no. No, not cliffhanger. Amazing how a game can be so popular and you play it and you're like, what was that about? Contra no, I'm too pathetic for Contra. As good as the game is. No, not Cutthroat Island. Oh, heck no. Oops, wrong button. Try again. Cyber spin. With a name like that, it's got to be good. Wow. The spinning 3D logo. I've never seen that before. Brand new. Japan. Oh. Am I controlling this? God, it controls very slippery. Ooh! How do they market a game that controls like this? Yeah, I'm out. If you guys are fans of this game, I apologise, but I could not control that. Cybernator. If you like horrible games, you've come to the right channel. The Cyber Nader. Oh, I've never really resonated with deck building games. I sort of can see the appeal, but I've never had the time to bother with one. Or the inclination is perhaps a better way of saying it. I don't know that language, just get me in the game. Not bad visuals. Mechs. I don't know that language, I don't want to read it because I can't understand it. When I jump it decides to pause decides to pause the action. That's annoying. Wow, destructive environments. Oh come on. 
Ouch. Yeah, I love I love games I can't read. I should take the opportunity and learn Spanish, shouldn't I? Like a good citizen. Other than that, you liked it. Don't need heavier weapons that can actually hurt these things. Yes. You better walk away, little man. Ah, oh, they're indestructible. I want to learn Spanish so badly. I'm still learning English. When I've finished English, I'll move on to Spanish. How about that? This game is interesting. Please blow up, thank you. Rocket boosters. Don't it's things about flattened batteries. I'm not a fan now. My rocket boosters aren't working. Oh, that's better. They're a bit better. Maybe that to charge up. This game likes to troll you. It seems. This is a very um, aggressive game. If you're not aggressive, you die. And I like to try and be thoughtful, but there's no being thoughtful, you just better walk through everything. Yeah. I used to play a game on the Xbox, one I used to love, called Titanfall. I enjoyed that you'd like be the character fighting in the battle, the sci-fi battle, like a first-person game, like Call of Duty. But then when you achieved enough, you've got a giant mech to fight in all that. I quite enjoyed that, the, the sort of, I don't know if it's the right word, but the meta game of the people fighting as humans and robots, and then they've only got the giant mechs fighting in the city all at once in an epic war. And I quite like Titanfall, I'd like to return to it. The original Titanfall, not the sequel. I don't know if you guys ever played it, but Titanfall is quite it's quite good. And the and the AI uses mechs to make the war bigger, so you've got um the players fighting and you've got AI controlled opponents to, so it's a proper battle and the, the mech aspect is amazing there's like four 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 or more giant mechs in a city fighting with you know with like twenty or whatever the humans all have the big battle as well. I'm done with this game. Yeah. I must return to Titanfall. I assume it's not dead. I assume people still play it. And I think the graphics are really nice. I've always enjoyed the graphics of Titanfall. I used to be quite good at it, believe it or not, because I had a build that people struggled with. And then eventually people wised up to my build and then I wasn't so good anymore. But I had my brief moment of power where people used to contact me asking for advice on builds. <laughs> but I haven't got the reflexes to be good because I'm, you know, I'm the best, the best person. Oh yeah, I really enjoy Titanfall. I think if I was, um, when it, you know, when it came out and I first played it years ago, it's an old game now, isn't it? If that would have come out a few years before that, I'd have lived on Titanfall instead of Gears of War. I might load it up later and see if it still, still works. English, my kind of game. Oh, play a name. Oh, God. I don't want to play a name. Hate player names. I never did play Titanfall 2, although I have got it. So I have to try it sometime. 
and also like Titanfall because it was an Xbox One exclusive. So at the time it was like, wow, an exclusive game that's not on the PlayStation. Whereas Titanfall 2 was a multi platform game, wasn't it? Am I going the wrong way? No, I'm not. The game's just been an arse. Oh god, now I've screwed it up. Play for pride, I suppose, now. Oh, come on. Oh, this game control's awful. I suppose I shouldn't be using the analog sticks. Oh, I can't play this. Yeah, Titanfall was the only sort of um, mech game that I ever really enjoyed. I think I just love the fact that there was a huge war with people and Titans. You know, I like the, the, the mechanics when you're the person and you can run up buildings and stuff. It reminded me of an anime, like Attack on Titan or something. Less fluff, more game, come on. Oh, I'm out of this game, it doesn't even take you to the game. Very cute. This looks like more like cauldron sort of game. I don't know what I'm clicking because I can't understand it, but what the heck? It gets me into the game rather than being stuck on a menu screen. Oh, very nice. Hopefully it plays well. And it's not too difficult. Ah, oh, proper anime. Wide eyes and big mouths. All the cute friends in the forest. This one here. Oh, cool. Sounds promising. Hi Chrono Baggy, welcome to the stream, I hope you're doing well my friend. Top Gear 2. I'm not a big racing game person, I only like some racing games, I mean I'll try anything but... No baggy said it. <laughs> so it is. Very nice graphics. And now they're speaking English. I'm so confused. I'm good enough to play it for a few minutes without, getting, without being stuck. What will be, will be. But if nothing else, I enjoy the graphics. Is this a platform game? If it's an RPG, I'm done. Oh, here we go. What powers they got? Bubbles. Come on. Is it a weapon? Yes, yes, yes. Is it like... Yeah, it's like Bubble Bubble. Very nice graphics. Yay. A character who can defend himself. This is a novelty. Go away, bird brain. Yeah, that's close. A 
I love these graphics. Very nice. Bit of the old parallax going on. I've got clothes. Bowling ball. I'm the man now. Oh, it was only a one-off. I had power for one brief moment in my life. Now it's gone. His mates. Farewell. He's a good character. He can defend himself. Okay. Spring. Spring is in the air. Whee! Goal. What a lovely game. Hopefully it don't get too hard. If it just stays like this, I'll be sorted. Wow, I bet that's cool to have on your DS. Let's get inside the vehicle. Yeah. Oh, the tree's kind. Is the cloud solid? Yes. Well, it's a springboard. Oh, crap. Ouch. Oh. Hello, Dios. Welcome to the stream. Hope you're doing well, my friend. Sorry if I've mispronounced your name. But it's the fourth that counts. <laughs> oh, is that down there? Take me down. I'll get down there. Horses, but different courses, that's the same. Yes, got there. Go away. I like this game. I don't know how long I'm going to sustain playing it without getting stuck, but I like it while it lasts. But this goes for a fortune on physical cartridge, doesn't it? Outside of my um, price range. What a shame. Returning a new leaf. Kidding me, are you? Bugger! Oh, this is not a good, a good, um, a good bit for when you've got input lag because you've got no um, margin. Well, very small margin for error, haven't you? We've got a on a, on a moving platform you have because <clears throat> at least with a stationary pla platform, you can allow for the input lag to a degree. Okay, I've got to just. Try and feel it. Might just be a coward and do that. Yeah, there we go. Oh. Oh, man. <clears throat> and here we are. Me reaching my limits of what I can do with this current setup. You've got to appreciate, guys. Um, when you have a emulation system, you've got lag. When you've got um, then hooked up straight to a capture card, you've got lag. And then you've got a wireless controller with lag. And then you add somebody who's not got the best reflexes and coordination in the world. And it's um, the margin for error is a lot reduced. Although not impossible. That was annoying. Ah, I enjoyed that, but I'm done. I couldn't hear the music, but I'm sure it was good. Not bloody Donkey Kong Country. Doom. Oh, 
off. Bloody hell. Try a bit of Doom. I've not spent much time on the SNES's version of Doom. I'll be interested in seeing how it holds up because most of my Doom experience has been on the Epic PlayStation 1 version and PC. The first time I played Doom properly was on the 32X, of all things, and I thought it was amazing. Then I played a real version of Doom on, like, you know... Okay, the controls are weird. God, this is a low-res, um, dark mess. Weird. What a pixelated mess. I suppose it was still a, tri a triumph for the SNES, weren't it? Perhaps it was a bit more um, forgiving on a CRT. Crap. Still, it's Doom. It feels like Doom. As long as you like single digit frames. How do you strafe on this? No strafe, no survive. to keep you guys on your toes. Ugh. This isn't even the proper map layout, man. certainly say <clears throat> the PlayStation 1 version le defeats this in every single way, although you'd expect it on the PlayStation's um, hardware. This is like playing Doom when you're drunk and it's so dark. Why is it so dark? My laptop's on maximum brightness. She's not got anything else to give, Captain. Variety is the spice of life. Or something like that. I want a better gun. Guns, lots of guns. Take me in. Ah, shotgun. I suppose, um, Doing this at all on the SNES was a, um, a victory. L36, but I'll be dead so you don't get off this abomination. Who's shooting me? It's annoying me now. Hard to control. It, it must be in the single, the single digit frame rates at times. There he is. It's hard to see you fighting when you can't see crap. Or perhaps I made it dark to hide the terrible uh, draw distance of frame rate. Making me ill, all that flashing. I don't mind when it's live, but. What the heck? Am I stuck against something? It's like it's stuck against the walls. But the backgrounds. I spent many hours on the PlayStation 1 Doom. Not that I'm, cl I'm not, <clears throat> I'm not claiming to be good at Doom, but I have had my time on it, and um, yeah, well, you see, the PlayStation 1. The reason why I'm so biased is, I think I've mentioned before, um, one of my best gaming experience is PlayStation 1 Doom, link up mode, two PlayStations, two TVs, two copies of the game, and a link cable, and doing the campaign in cooperative on the hardest skill setting. It's, um, 
darn fine gaming experience, even by today's standards. At least for a saddo like me. It's on my own, it seems a bit like half-baked. Especially on a half-baked version. The darkness is oppressive. I know Doom needs a bit of darkness, but not like this. It's not even a dark room half the time, it's just after the game's made. Wow, cauldron. Is Doom not cute enough for you? Doom's like every other old game. If it's got that nostalgia, then the context of it is how awesome it is. But if you've not got the nostalgia, it probably looks like a bunch of pixel men having a fight, doesn't it? And old, you know, old games like that. There's something special to it, but to some people, it's wasted on them. Like many of you, you know, well not many, but quite a few of you guys' games that I've not played, they mean nothing to me, so I play it quite unbiasedly, and then I kind of go, oh, it doesn't really stand out to me, but you've got those memories, so it means a heck of a lot. Before the days of the PlayStation 1, this probably would have blew my mind, but the PlayStation 1 version, for me, is just... I'm going to have to turn this off, guys, because it's making me eyes, my head hurt with the, with the darkness and then the flashing, so... I, I totally and utterly respect um, that they, were, they never had much to work with. And they made it Valiant. Valiant port. Wow, mode 7 time. Doomsday Warrior. Let's go for it. Easy. I like it easy. What? I don't want an RPG, I just want to play a game. Sledge, what else we got? Laban. Amon, Daisy, P. Lump, P. Lump, really? That's fat shaming, isn't it? P. Lump, Brimrock, New Form, I'll be New Form. Hold oh, on, that's all, I bet that's awesome. Select a rival. I'm gonna fight Daisy. Pretend it's Daisy Ridley from Star Wars. I want to punish her for her terrible Star Wars films. Well, I'd rather get Ryan Johnson in the game instead and punish him, but you know, you have to take what you can get. Oh god, what am I playing? I'm gonna whack you with my sleeve, yeah. That looked a bit defiling. Who did Street Fighter 2 when you've got this? Goodbye, Daisy. I'm a poor man's Green Lantern. I'm gonna plunge her. Yes. She fights valiantly, but it's futile. This is meant to be a beat em up game, you have to press a button to jump. What beat em up game has a button for jumping? Nice fan. I'm like a, um, oh, I can do upgrades. Upgrades. This game is amazing, Dark. I don't want to hear anything of her. It's the best game ever. We will respect this amazing game. Who shall I fight now? I'm going to fight P. Lump. Back in the 90s when you could fat shame someone. Fat Bomber. He's not plump, he's just cuddly. They need to stop it, don't they?
feel like a poor man's no face from um, Spirit of the Way. Pretty lump sucked. Whoever made this game had no shame. I'm proud of them. Don't diss the game. I'm gonna fight Grimrock. Oh, you don't like the T1000, do you? I thought you liked the TA100. remotely killable. This game has, has got a bigger budget than Street Fighter 2 ever had. Oh, this Grimlock is kicking my ass. He's learned how to block. Grimlock. Beating up is so natural. What am I doing now? What have I turned into? You're strange. This game is wrong. Oh, come on, Grimlock, stop kicking my ass. Come here. Hey, you get special moves. That's not fair. going to. I lose. What a shame I'm going to have to leave this game now. I really enjoyed this game. What a load of rubbish. This looks like your kind of games, I'll put it on. No doubt I'll stink at it, but I'll give it a go. Give it a go. We'll just, that last game, we'll just put that game behind us and never talk about it ever again. Oh yes, look at this. I bet you two know this game, don't you? Oh no, not that language. I don't even know what the heck that language is. I'm just gonna bypass it. It's not even Japanese. Just let me in the game, darn it. I've been to it, Cauldron, when I was about 15, 14, 15. I want to be the putty cat. It's beautiful, man. Oh, yes. Can I fight? Or is it a non violent game? Maybe I can jump on people's heads. I've never played this game. I don't think I have anyway. But it looks vaguely familiar, like it's a cartoon or something. Oh, bloody dog. Yeah, he's dead. Oh, it is an anime. I was right. That's probably why I'm familiar with it. Stop shooting things at me, you dragon. Ah, oh, the dog's after me! Aye, aye. I've got a friend. A friend. Friends are there. I'm not a very popular fellow in this world. Ow! Oh, and that fist. 
Yes, I've got powers. Stupid dog. Yeah, I'm a killing machine now. It's a pretty game, I'll give it that. That dog's bloody annoying though. He's an evil devil. I'm not dice, that's it. Or die. Come on. Come back, floating platform. Ow! Yeah, I'm a fish slayer. I'm a jump. A leap of faith. Oh, a leap of death. No more leaps of faith. Oh, I've lost my body. I want my body back. Ah, well. <gasps> Meow! Oh, I missed. I got no hope. I should be called Bob Hope, no hope. Oops, I shouldn't have done that, Harry. Oh, I'm alright, I'm alright. Oh. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm invisible. Yeah, well. We, um. We all have to try something different, don't we? I get the strange feeling I won't be playing it for very, very long because I'm not, um, I'm not proving to be very good at it. <laughs> that last stage with the jumping platforms just pushed me, and that was the first level. I want to be somebody else. I'll be. Oh God, what a motley crew! I'll be this little girl cat thing. I bet you guys know all the names, don't you? Oh. Oh, they gave you that nice statue, didn't they? They must like you. Oh, for God's sake, this is driving me, dude. Lally, I can't even get past this screen. Oh, here we go. I can fly. I believe I can fly. Don't think you can fly, Neo. Know it. Yes. It's turned into a cute up now. Bloody spikes. Nothing worse than a spike. Oh, God's sake! Oh, God, I've got to get it! Oh. They don't, they, don't, they don't like English people. No, 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 no! There's always exceptions. I think we need to move on past the 100 years war, perhaps. The past is in the past. Ah, I'm through. Is this multi-layered scrolling that I can see? Super Nintendo, you are a powerhouse. Ouch. Blind cats are amazing. Come on, look at that bluebird. I'd like to play a Flash Gordon game where I'm on a rocket cycle. Oh, I don't want to do it again. Oh, for God's sake. This game is losing me. Perhaps they're jealous because they want to live in Belgium. 
Is there any EU they can live in Belgium, can't they? So I don't know what the problem is. Clear. My will to live is clear after playing that. <laughs> My reward, more crap. That's good, isn't it? That's very good. I can under I can understand a fair degree of French, so I could probably ma I could probably manage on the menus myself. But I did do five years of it at school, so it gives you a little bit of basics. As much as I tried not to learn anything, you know, some of it does stick, doesn't it? I hate this game. I'm out. I tried. I tried this game. Sorry, Cauldron. I just exited when you said that. Well, I don't. I don't hate it. That's not true. I. I'm drained by it. Dragon Ball Z. Oh god, not Dragon Ball Z. Dragon View. Dragon's Magic. Dragon. The Bruce Lee story. I bet that's good. I remember that was on about every single console. Even the Jaguar had it. The Atari Jaguar. The most pointless system ever invented. That's correct, Dark. Good and bad people everywhere. Hong Kong, 1949. No, I don't need to see this. Sorry, Cauldron, I left as you, I left as it just before you said that, and I was drained on it anyway. I was completely drained. I can only do so long in these games. Why am I? Why can't I just play the game? Why am I getting cutscenes? Here we go. <laughs> this isn't Jeet Kune Do. That's Jeet Kune. That sidekick was Jeet Kune Do. Where you turn right backwards. Yeah, right. As if an average sailor could block those kicks. That's not Jeet Kune Do. Punches in the Jeep and do because you do a, a vertical punch, not a horizontal punch. What am I using Fei Long for? Oh no, Fei Long is more realistic Jeep and do. Can I block? Do I have a block button? So Bruce Lee can't block, but the sailor can. What a load of crap. Bruce Lee did not learn to block, only the sailor did. He can do a bloody tiger uppercut, that sailor can. Bruce Lee lost to a sailor. He's got a chain in there. What else he got down there? Game is crap. That's not Jeet Kune Do. Bruce Lee can't block, guys. I've not found a button to block. The sailor can do blocks, but Bruce Lee can't. I, he kick, he punches. I kick. He's got a great range on his punch. I know Bruce Lee were a tall chap, but you know. He wasn't that small, he wasn't a hobbit from the Shire. Oh, those flying jump kicks are GG Kudo, no, that's just what he did in movies. This game is. Oh, I can't play it any longer, it's so annoying. There's no respect to Bruce Lee in that.
Um, anything here that remotely... <clears throat> well, sailors probably were quite tough, but they can do blocks and Bruce Lee can't. And, you know, it, it, it's just terrible, terrible game. That guy was on about Top Gear, weren't he? He was requesting it, he should have said I'd have to put it on for him. Let's have a look at Top Gear. Yeah, it's crap. Here we go. Top Gear 2. He said it's the greatest racing game on the SNES. Uh, I can't remember his name. Dirt, not, no, it won't do it. Won't. Yeah. Earthbound, I would have to do earlier on in his stream in the last four minutes. It's probably going to take up a lot of time. Oh god, this isn't even in English. Yeah, I can't play. I can't play an RPG in the last four, three and a half minutes of the stream, can I? Really? This game is no good. It's not even English. Toy Story, not his chance. Trials of Mana, it's got Secret of Mana 3 on it. Fan bloody tastic. Even better than Earthbound. True Lies, oh god. Turbo Tunes, let's try Turbo Tunes. The Super Nintendo. Anna Barbera. Oh, well, I thought it was some irrelevant thing. Yeah, I will do Earthbound one day, but not this day. <laughs> Don't forget to pick your baskets. Oh. Hey, hey, boo, get the game on. I don't want to put my name in. I just want to play the goddamn game. Yes, don't bark. What the heck's going on? I thought I was joking there. Mm -hmm. What the bloody hell am I doing? I don't think it's as bloody hell as What is this game about? I'm not even controlling anyone. Oh, my Kung Fu, on Kung Fu. -y. I thought I was Yogi Bear. People really paid money for this crap. Get out of the way. I'm not Deputy Doggy from no one, I'm out. I wasn't even controlling anyone. Ah, uh, a bit of the old fighter jet. Can we end on a high? Nineteen ninety-three. I wasn't controlling anyone, it was nothing. It was just a complete waste of time, it, even though I picked Yogi. Oh wow, look at this. I bet Tom Cruise is flying that. And his booster seat. The internet's not down. Are we on? Sorry about that, I don't know why, but the internet went down. The joys of live streaming. But we're back. Baby, we're back. Take me off. Where's the afterburners on this piece of jaw? Welcome back. Um, okay, this game's complicated. Yeah, my internet went down or something. Yeah, this game's crap.
trying to be complicated. You can't be complicated with a controller. You just need press a button and you fly off. We're good. Just ready. Just ready to 